thirsty kids. Time traveling Thomas here. And me. Carl. Uh, it's. It's so dark, cold, and windy. It's so cold and dark. It, it's even a little bit scary. I agree. I think I might need a nightlight. I think I might need a blanket. And some hot chocolate. <gasps> Wait a second. Or a mocha. Did you hear that? Ah! What is it? That's the Holy Spirit. <gasps> He's flying in the middle of the darkness. I can't see anything. Th but did you know that God isn't afraid of the dark? Well, that's good. Darkness in the Bible is, is symbolic for sin, evil, the bad stuff, death. But we don't have to be afraid of the dark or bad stuff or, or evil or sin. We don't have to fear any of it. We don't? Because what do you think God is afraid of? I can't hear you. What do you think God is afraid of? Nothing! I can't hear you. What did you say? Nothing! Oh my goodness, that was so loud. I think it may have broke my eardrums. <laughs> you know, Genesis 1-2, it says the Spirit of God was flying in the middle of the darkness. Why don't we fly with Holy Spirit today? Yes. Through the darkness. Yes. Let's fly. Let's fly. Let's fly, Thomas. I believe I can fly. Fly twice as high. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. We're in rainbow. Cause I can't go anywhere. Wow! Wow! Yeah, I know, Thomas. I got sucked up in a black hole. <laughs> I'm gonna go visit Enoch.